Hi guys, I'm Nimi Melvin from Nimi Sat. Today I'm going to do a summer painting with a cute bear and a surfboard. So let's start. I'm using acrylic pad, palette paper, pencil, eraser, sharpie, brushes, acrylic paints, a cup of water and paper towel. Instead of acrylic paper, you can use canvas or any thick paper. I'm going to start with an oval shape. So just leave some gap at the top, then mark it. Then you can draw a big oval shape for the face, for the head. Then another big oval shape for the body. Two thin oval shape for the hand. One here. Another one here. And two ovals for the legs. So we got overall shape. Now we have to draw the details and I'm going to erase some overlapping lines and I'm going to clean up the drawing. So let's make it darker. Slightly darker so you can see that shape neatly. Now we have to add the big oval shape for the surfboard. So just start from the same position of the leg till here. So just below the head. So make a big curve. Then you can draw the second one on the other side. So it's like a big um, kind of oval shape. Then you can erase that, you know, this shape inside this. Now I'm going to add the details on the face. So you can make a triangle like shape. I can draw oval too. A small oval for the nose, one straight line, and a small curve, another straight line with a small curve. And the eye is like a small tiny circle, and you can draw a half circle for the ear. You can add one more for the detail and add a big oval shape for the tummy. So this is going to be a different color when you paint and some lines for the toes and hand. So we have completed drawing the bear. Now we can add the background details. So just start with a big straight line, a horizontal line over this. Then you can add some clouds above it and some wavy lines for the waves of the ocean. I'm going to add three. You can add any number. Two. And the last one is just below it. And on the side, you can add some leaves, palm leaves, one curve, and some zigzag line. The second one, zigzag line one a small one about now if you want you can add some details in the background here you can add crab shells or starfish so I'm going to add a small crab here oval circle straight line the tiny dot for the eye and the smiling face then you can add that you know the curve triangle with this shape, curve, straight line, curve, straight line, and three legs on each side. And you can add any patterns on the surfboard. I'm going to add a wavy line to show a wave and some straight lines.
So we have completed the drawing. Before starting the painting, I'm going to outline the drawing with Sharpie. So this is completely optional. So you have to use a permanent marker or black Sharpie that is permanent ink. Don't use normal markers because that can spread into the paint when you start painting. Just use your Sharpie or just darken the lines with pencil. So let's start painting. I'm going to start painting from the sky. So this is some cobalt blue and you can use any blue you like. Mix some white into it, make it into a lighter tone of blue and you can paint this area with blue color. Now I'm going to mix colors for the ocean. So we need three tones of blue. So just start from here. So this is going to be my dark blue. Then I'll make a little bit lighter blue with this one. And the last one is going to be very light with more white. So three different values of the same color so we just lighten it with white and this is going to be here this one is going to be here and the darker one is going to be here so i'm using a different brush just keep the brush there and then take another brush and start painting from here and use horizontal strokes for painting this area Now we can start with the next color, add a little bit of water, make sure you have enough paint to cover this area. Then the last lighter tone. So this is our third value. Now we can paint the sand. So I'm going to use some yellow ochre. So this is yellow ochre, you can see this color. And if you don't have yellow color, you can use some yellow color, any bright yellow or medium yellow. And add some white into it.
now i'm going to paint palm leaves with lighter green sort of turn a bit of white to make it a bit now it's time to paint bear and surfboard so you can take some burnt sienna Burnt sienna means light brown and then you can paint the bear with this color. I'm going to add a little bit of white into the brown to make it a little bit opaque. We can take some yellow plus white for the, the nose and tummy. black for eye and nose. Don't forget to add a white dot for the eye. And now we can color the surfboard with any color you like. This, your des design will be different than mine, so you can use any color for your design. and some orange color for the crab so if you don't have orange you can mix some red plus yellow or else you can just take some light brown and I'm going to add eyebrows for the Teddy bear. And a white dot on the nose. So if you want, you can add these brown dots just to show that the scrap came from this side.
and you can add some gray shadows for the cloud and that is also completely optional take a lighter gray add more white just add a shadow on one side of the cloud and one side of this surfboard and this is completely optional and if everything is dry you can take your black sharpie again and outline I have completed the painting. I hope you really enjoyed it. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.